So what is art finance? Art finance is simply making a loan secured by fine art as collateral. Our borrowers are generally in four categories, collectors, dealers, investors, and trusts. Collectors generally use the loan proceeds to buy either more art, either many pieces or one significant piece to increase their collection. Investors may decide to invest in the art and hold over a period of time and use the loan for leverage to increase their returns. Trusts may use the loan to monetize the art that may be in a significant trust corpus and make a payment to their beneficiaries. How do we structure art loans? Well, art loans are generally one to three year interest only loans with a one year make whole feature. We identify eligible collateral and will lend up to 50% depending on many unique factors. And we will lend against the net realizable value or marketable cash value as it's called in the art market. We generally require the pieces to be stored and in our possession. And we require a default reserve account to be held in the event that interest cannot be serviced. And we perform annual reappraisals on a mark-to-market -market basis so that we can understand that the borrower is in compliance with its borrowing base. What are the qualifications we look for in a client? First and foremost, their ability to service the loan, particularly given that the art doesn't generate cash flow. It's actually a cash flow negative asset because it requires uh, the backing of insurance and many times it's stored in a storage facility. So we look for clients who have the ability to service the loan and have liquidity or cash flow coming from another source. Uh, so that's very, very important. Also, we have a certain net worth threshold. So generally, we're looking for clients who have a net worth that you know, has some significance above the amount of money that we're lending um, because that will provide protection. We're also looking for clients who have a very solid reputation in the market and character. That's of the utmost importance to Yield Street. We also look uh, to ensure that the primary source of repayment for the loan is the art collateral and that the art collateral has enough liquidity to satisfy that requirement. So let me tell you about the due diligence process at Athena. We do a significant deep dive analysis around the art, particularly around its ownership, its authenticity, its provenance, its condition, its valuation, and its liquidity. And we have data analytics to back it up. Analysis of the borrower's financial wherewithal to service the interest, again, very important, along with net worth. And we do do very, very rigorous KYC, AML, and all legal searches so that we understand the risks behind the borrowers. With regards to our clients and discretion, we are very discreet. We uh, maintain the fullest extent of confidentiality. We will sign confidentiality agreements on a case-by-case -case basis. So that is extremely important for us. And of course, uh, with regards to the platform, that's always kept at top of mind. So what excites me about Yield Street's future? It's offering investors easy access to alternative credit products in a way that has never been done before. The fact that we're growing to new asset classes for our investors, and the fact that we're being innovative and disruptive of the traditional banking model.